Hey, what is on guys? This is Cloud here. And today's video is episode two of Cloudy Tries Botting, which is a series where I try to learn how to bot, take a lot of L's along the way, and then hopefully by the end of the series, I'll be a decent botter. If you guys missed last episode, I did end up copying a Air Force One using F3, which is a big W because that is like very easy profit. The Air Force One sell very easily. So that is a big, big W. So I'm really happy on that. And that is super, super dope. Also, before getting to the live cop, I want to give a big shout out to Oculus Servers for providing me with a server to use, which is really dope. And then shout out to Renault Assist who provided me with a bot to use for these drops. So that is really awesome. So shout out to my sponsors. Also, Rental Assist is running a giveaway for $10 to use on any bot rental. So if you guys want to go enter the giveaway they are running for me, then just join the Discord in the description down below to go enter the giveaway that they set up for me to win $10 of rental credit to use towards any bot rental. So the very first drop of the video, I'm going to be going for the Nike Dunk Highs in the Michigan colorway. I believe that's what they are called. I will be using So AIO. That is a bot in the video. So let's get into the live cop. So right here, I'm on running it for Kif. I put in the early links and everything. I'm also running it for a few other websites that was supposed to drop it, such as Nice Kicks and I believe some other like uh, Shopify sites. But as you guys can see, I try to go for one manually, but it puts you into the queue because that is how Shopify works. The queue really sucks and that is just an issue. And I mean, the bot for some reason just wasn't really working. I don't know what I did wrong. It's definitely a mistake with me because I believe that the So AO bot actually did really, really good on this drop. So I don't know what I personally did wrong that made me take such a big L because people really did cook out on this drop with So AO. A lot of people got the items they wanted, which is like sucks for me. I don't know what I did wrong. I'll have to figure it out before the next drops that I go for because I want to eventually be able to hit the product I want. I don't want to keep taking L's. That really, really sucks. So yeah, that is super annoying. But L on the Nike Michigan Dunks. Also, I want to show you guys that I did get my Air Force Ones right here. Let me unbox it for you guys. Obviously, it comes with the extra pair of Supreme laces, which are really, really dope. These actually are so dope. If I had the Air Force Ones, I'd probably put in these red laces. Actually, nah, it just looks so clean without the red laces. And then here's the shoe, and I really wish this was my size, even though I do want to resell them because like this is so freaking clean like take a look at that such a clean shoe like holy crap this is so nice if this was a size 11 and a half you guys already know i would be trying it on right away because these are fire the next drop that i'm gonna be going for are the pj tucker kobe's and the adidas top 10 boba fett whatever collab that they're doing with star wars so yeah that's gonna be the next drop in the video and this drop was also at 7 a.m. on September 25th. Well, for me, it's 7 a.m. It is for other people, it is 10 a.m., 10 p.m. I mean, 10 a.m. EST. But yeah, as you guys can see, I'm going for them. I'm like changing the delays because you want to have like long delays before the drop. And then right at the drop, you want to change it to low delays. And I was trying to get early links for the KIF kobe's but i never ended up getting them so that kind of screwed me over on that part and i'm going also going for foot locker which is like the main website that i'm focusing on i'm trying to hit them on foot locker because i've had had success hitting drops on foot locker so that is why i am really focusing on foot locker i'm not really confident on shopify sites because they are really complicated you got soft captures and all that kind of stuff and it is just a really really confusing process. So I did not really want to worry about that. Also, I was going for the Bodega uh, New Balances. I believe they are a Bodega collab, maybe not. The New Balance Better Days, I forgot to mention that I was going for that also. And right there, I get the checkpoint capture, which is like a thing with KISS website. And then it gets to this screen where like I couldn't reach the site. I think it's because I was on a server and I forgot to put in a, uh, what's it call it? The, proxy for the harvesters which i think that was the issue i'm assuming that was the issue i'm assuming that was one of the issues because i probably did a lot of things wrong and i'm assuming that's just one of the things that i did very very wrong so took an l on every drop that i went for this week which is not good because i gotta take some w's but then again in the last episode i said that my goal is to become a good botter by around episode 5 to 10 and then I'll probably make this a different series if I actually become like good at botting. I'll make this like a different series. But right now, I'm very noob at botting. 
So, so far, episode one was a W, episode two is an L. Let's see what episode three has for us. So, if you guys do want to see episode three, please drop me a like down below. I appreciate all likes you guys drop me. Subscribe to the channel to stay tuned for the next episode. Make sure to go enter the rental assist giveaway. And that's it. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Run it out, get your bag right now, yeah. Hide it out to your face right now, yeah.